Alright guys, so you might have known that 6 9 just dropped a new album, and honestly, it is one of the worst albums I've ever heard. It's called like Title Tales, and I'm not gonna lie, I do respect 6 9 for being a absolutely amazing troll, but this dude is one of the worst musicians in the industry. And not gonna lie, this album continues to prove that 6 9 is gonna do nothing but go downhill after this, man. Yo, what's good everyone? Thieven here. Welcome back to a brand new video. So yeah, 6 9s new album is honestly one of the worst albums. I've heard ever and again it is called Tattletales which let me just be honest that's a pretty clever name and I do think that that is hilarious just kind of rubbing it in the face of everyone that hates him that he told on everyone so you know what man I do like that and I do find that pretty hilarious but I think the content in the album is just awful like it's one of the worst albums I've ever heard there's only three good tracks on this album and that's kind of being generous I wouldn't even say that to be honest but there's only really three good tracks on this album and like the rest are like trying to be R&B and like with a mix of reggae I don't really understand what he was going with these. They sound really, really awful. I mean, I'll say this. It is smart of him to try and make a new style of music for himself because he is not respected in the rap game anymore and no one's really going to work with him. I'm honestly extremely surprised that he got Akon on his album because I think that's the only person that he's ever going to really work with that is at least respectable. Because I mean, okay, Nicki Minaj is kind of respectable, but not insanely respectable because she does whatever she can to get more views. But Akon actually is is respectable so I don't understand why he got on this album this dude is gonna lose a lot of respect in the industry and then he got some dude named left side I don't really know who that is but I'm sure that it's like an up-and-coming rapper maybe so you know what he doesn't really have much to lose I think that it was probably a good decision on his part but I think the most insane feature on this album bro this dude literally got academics on this album this dude got little AK on this album academics the fact that DJ academics is on this album makes me want to leave this planet bro not gonna lie this is what mainstream music is nowadays. We have DJ Academics on this album now, bro. I don't I don't even know what to say. I'm honestly just at a loss for words on how stupid that is. So out of all the artists on this album, we only have one that is a respectable name in rap. So yeah, I think that he actually did end his career with snitching everyone out. I mean, it was either that or, you know, go to prison for life. So I think that he still did make the right choice as far as saving his own life. So yeah, this dude essentially did ruin his career. I think that he's only going to get like 30,000, maybe 40,000 records first week which would be a big major L for him considering the fact that Dummy Boy did 66,000 albums first week with 10,000 of those being pure sales so yeah I really don't think that this is going to go very well for him. Yeah 6 9 sucks guys he is not the king of New York and if you think that then honestly you're stupid. I think this guy is going to fall off harder than anyone in the industry so yeah don't be surprised when this dude is like trying to beg for views in a couple years. I'm not going to lie I think that this dude is pretty alright as a drill rapper don't get me wrong. I don't think that he's an amazing drill rapper or anything, but I think he's all right. But this whole R&B reggae thing that he's trying to do, especially with all the singles that he dropped besides the one with Nicki Minaj, were all pretty much drill rap. I don't really know what he was really doing. I mean, dude, the fact that Lil AK is in this album is just so ridiculous. But anyway, guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and end off the video there. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. If you do end up subscribing, turn on those post notifications. If you do end up turning on those post notifications and you want to see what I'm doing in my personal life, make sure to check out all my other outlets in the description below. I would really appreciate that. And honestly, guys, don't waste your time on this album. This album is trash, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and peace. Oh my,